Hello, and a very warm welcome to LNT Royal YouTube channel. I spoke about this on my story a few days ago. Well, I'll bring it up again. It's great seeing the Sussexes living up to their promise on SussexRoyal.com. One being to work with a diverse group of people in the media and creative industry. The chat between Gloria Steinem and Megan was filmed earlier this month by world renowned entertainment photographer Matt Sales. He is a person of colour and was stated by Omid Scobby on Twitter, has always ensured his work reflects what the world looks like, from gender and race to age and size. The photos taken of the Sussexes at a Baby to Baby event to bring awareness to the great work being done by the organisation was taken by bilingual photojournalist Christian Monterosa. Another great plus, Christian and Matt are from Megan's hometown of Los Angeles. So it's great to see the Sussexes helping those from creative fields too. Meg, welcome home. I'm Thank you. so glad that you're home. Me too, for so many reasons. Great. Fantastic. I'm ready. But are you excited? Very excited. Okay. You can't see behind the mask, but I am excited. People forget how hard women like you and so many others before you fought for us to just be where we are right now. Well, it's just, I mean, when you, if you don't vote, you don't exist. Mm -hmm. I yeah. mean, you know, it is the only place where we're all equal, the voting yeah. booth. Um, hi, buddy. Come here. You know, what worries me the most are young people who I understand are the least likely to vote. Uh, and I can understand the feeling that they don't think they have an impact. Mm -hmm. And yet it's more important for them to vote than anyone else because they're going to be alive long after I am. <laughs> and, and, and they're going to be suffering the consequences. Do you feel hopeful? Oh, yes. No, no, no. I, I do feel hopeful. I. I I just want to say <laughs> that movements are families. It's no sacrifice. Mm -hmm. I get to do what I love and care about every day of my life. How great is that? Well, best. almost every day. <laughs> <laughs> Today's a pretty great day. <laughs> yeah, today is a great day. I get to day. see it. No, right. so... Another report. The royal family was not built to handle someone like Meghan Markle. When Meghan, Duchess of Sussex and Prince Harry decided to step down from being senior royals in early 2020, many people pointed the finger at Meghan herself. There were and still are a lot of talks about her not understanding what it means to be a Duchess, and how her background made it difficult for her to be in the role of a royal. However, a royal expert believes there were also many things wrong on the royal family side. In fact, the expert thinks the institution of royalty itself was simply not built to handle a person like Meghan. Meghan Markle had a hard time in the royal family. Since the very beginning of her courtship with Harry, Meghan has been at odds with the British press. Negative stories about her have been printed on a daily basis, with some of them being based simply on her background as a mixed, raced American actor. Unfortunately, as a royal, she was also expected to not respond publicly to rumours and negative media coverage. According to the new biography Finding Freedom by Omid Scobby and Carolyn Durand, Meghan also faced some difficulties with royal courtiers who was not used to dealing with a progressive and outspoken duchess. In the 2019 documentary Harry and Meghan, An African Journey, Meghan revealed that she had been struggling in the royal family, especially when she was pregnant. She said, as reported by Vogue, any woman, especially when they are pregnant, you're really vulnerable. So that was made really challenging. And then when you have a newborn, you know, it's a very real thing to be going through behind the scenes. Meghan reportedly felt she did not get enough support from other royals. According to Finding Freedom, Meghan also reportedly felt she did not get enough support when she was struggling as a new royal. More specifically, the book alleged Catherine, Duchess of Cambridge, should have reached out to Meghan, but she did not do so. Scobby and Duran said, Meghan was disappointed that she and Kate hadn't bonded over the position they shared, but she wasn't losing sleep over it. According to a source, Kate felt they didn't have much in common, other than the fact that they lived at Kensington Palace. Still, 
Megan reportedly would have liked for Kate to check in on her during the most difficult times with the press. A royal expert believes the royal family was not built to handle someone like Meghan. At the heart of it all, Scobby believes the royal family did try to help Meghan as best they could. However, the institution itself was not made to accommodate someone like Meghan. Scobby said, When we look at the immediate royal family, I think they clearly did support Harry and Meghan to some extent. Unfortunately, the institution itself is not built to handle someone coming in who is different, or is as dramatically different as Meghan was. He added, It's a shame because I think the royal family had this incredible chance to be seen as inclusive and diverse and progressive. But that's gone now, ending a very short chapter for the monarchy. Another analysis. Fans believe Prince Harry failed Meghan Markle in one important way. Prince Harry and Meghan, Duchess of Suffolk's first met in 2016. The pair had a whirlwind romance before tying the knot in 2018. Today, they have one son together. According to Finding Freedom, the new biography about the couple, Harry and Meghan have many things in common and are a great match in various ways. However, fans think there is one part of their marriage in which Harry failed Meghan. Meghan Markle had a hard time in the royal family. In the beginning, their relationship felt like a fairy tale. Harry and Meghan's wedding was watched all over the world, with fans tuning in to see an American coroner marrying into the British royal family. Unfortunately, things went downhill for Meghan, who was constantly receiving negative news in the British press. As royal, she was not allowed to speak out to correct on true rumours, which was reportedly difficult for the outspoken former actor. The book Finding Freedom also shared that Meghan's life was made difficult by royal courtiers who judged her for her background. Additionally, as a progressive, she had a hard time adjusting to the rigidness and traditions that being a royal entails. Why do fans think Prince Harry failed Meghan Markle? Although there are no doubt things that were out of Harry and Meghan's control, fans believe Harry could have done more to prepare Meghan for her role. In this instance, fans think Harry failed Meghan because it did not seem like Meghan knew exactly what to expect as a royal. When discussing on Reddit about the royal family's traditional ways, one person said, I truly believe that Harry failed Meghan and Meghan was keen to marry Harry as quickly as possible. Harry failed to prepare her, either due to her ability to act, thinking she'd be able to adapt quickly, or due to fear of losing her, or due to God knows what. But he failed her, the fan also added. They both failed to understand that the true nature of being a royal is adapting to changes within the institution first, and then changing the institution from within. Kate Middleton had a longer time to prepare for her role as a duchess. Unlike Meghan, her sister-in-law, Catherine, Duchess of Cambridge, seemed to have a better time adjusting to the royal family. Of course, Kate was the object of much negative press as well, and she faced some struggles when she first became a duchess. However, Kate actually had a longer time to prepare for her role. Kate and Prince William first met in the early 2000s as university students. The two of them dated for many years before getting married in 2011. Compared to Meghan's two-year courtship, Kate had a lot more time to see what it was like to marry into the royal family. These days, Kate seems to excel in her role as a duchess. She consistently receives favourable approval ratings from the public, with her parenting skills being widely praised. T Royal Channel by Subscribe Channel like and share videos are. Your support is the motivation for our to produce better videos. Don't stop.